so uh, here we need to find the integral of sine inverse 2x by 1 plus x square into dx and limits are from 0 to 1 so here if we take if we take x equals to tan theta then 2x by 1 plus x square that is equal to 2 tan theta by 1 plus tan square theta that is equal to sine 2 theta and then dx can be written as sec square theta d theta and when x is going from 0 to 1 then theta theta will be equal to theta will be obviously equal to tan inverse of x so tan inverse so theta will go from tan inverse 0 to tan inverse 1 it means theta will theta will go from 0 to pi by 4 so this integral can be written as 0 to pi by 4 0 to pi by 4 so this will be sine inverse of this is sine sine 2 theta to dx is sec square theta d theta so this will be equal to 0 to pi by 4 sine inverse sine 2 theta is 2 theta into sec square theta d theta sec square theta d theta so this will be equal to um, here we can write it as integral here uh, here we have to use the integration by parts um, we have to use the islet rule to choose the first and the second function so the algebraic function should be chosen as the first function and sec square theta this is the trigonometric function so it should be chosen as the second function so it will be 2 theta integral sec square theta d theta from uh, okay no limits we should apply at the end so this will be then uh, this will minus integral d by d theta of 2 theta then integ into integral sec square theta d theta whole integral d theta and here also whole integral d theta so here also the limits will go from 0 to pi by 4 so this will be 2 theta integral sec square sec square theta is tan theta then minus uh, d of 2 theta by d theta that is 2 so minus integral 2 into integral sec square theta is tan theta d theta and that should go from 0 to pi by 4 so this will be equal to 2 theta into tan theta minus 2 into integral tan theta is log mod sec theta log mod sec theta from 0 to pi by 4 so this we can write it as also 2 into 2 into theta tan theta plus log mod cos theta from 0 to pi by 4 since why here uh, 1 by sec, sec theta is 1 by cos theta so we can write it as minus log cos theta so minus of minus will be plus here so this will be 2 into then we can put the values here so it will be pi by 4 tan pi by 4 pi by 4 into tan pi by 4 plus log mod cos pi by 4 then minus 0 into tan 0 plus log mod cos 0 cos 0 is 1 and log of 1 is equal to 0 so therefore this part is 0 and 
this is tan 0 so tan 0 is 0 also so this whole part will be 0 so the final answer will be 2 into 2 into this pi by 4 into tan pi by 4 is 1 then plus log mod cos pi by 4 is 1 by root 2 so this will be so therefore it will be equal to 2 into pi by 4 plus 2 into pi by 4 then this will become we can write it as minus log root 2 this will be minus log root 2 and root 2 means 2 power half so this half I can take it here also so this will be 2 into pi by 4 minus 2 into 1 by 2 log 2 so this 2 and 2 will cancel 2 to the 4 so the final answer is pi by 2 minus log 2 so this is the final answer of this integral thank you